Along with onions, I'm going to add okra. Because when I went to the store, yes. this in our part of the country is uh, bindi. This is called bindi, bindi pulsu. Yeah. And then the nice curry leaves. Just put it in a small food processor and crush it. So you crush this onion to give body to the dish. And it's being added to the onions that have been sautéing already that have been chopped. So you have two different consistencies of onion. One is to give more body to the dish. Too much of uh, uh, cinnamon, too much of other things. But the main thing here is fresh roasted uh, coriander, little jeera, little cumin, and maybe just a touch of cinnamon. This has a different flavor. If you all want the very first one that we rolled it. Okay, we're adding a little bit of salt. Okay. So we're adding some turmeric to the onion and green chili mixture. So now we're adding ginger and green chili paste. The okra. Uh, today's uh, the main ingredient for the sauce is tamarind paste or tamarind. Tamarind, I think you all know, my, in, you know, a big tree, tropical tree, and it gets parts like bean parts like this. Actually, I got them from the Indian store. Here you, know, you get the Indian stores also sell the pulp and then make a sauce out of it. It's not that you get the little paste. <laughs> this is also fresh one I just got from India. Uh, you know, I have a cousin who is so nice. She takes care of all my needs. She gives me. <laughs> so Chris is adding tamarind paste. She's added about a teaspoon to the okra and the onions. Yeah. One tablespoon at least. <laughs> One tablespoon. <laughs> yeah. Or even more. I might add more. And we need to add a little water to it. Actually, she's adding another spoon of tamarind paste, adding some chili powder. And the chili powder cover your fish curry. So that they won't fall apart too fast. And then what I'm going to do is add it to the sauce once this starts. And then usually for a couple of hours, or even they say it's even better the next morning or whatever. Uh, but we don't have all that luxury. Oh. <laughs> I'm so glad I came here. I like the Oh, yeah, maybe add extra water to your curry sauce. Oh, that so delicious. And we need to add now and let it simmer all this and let it simmer. A little and something. Add the fish to the sauce. The fish is partially cooked. It's been sauteed in various herbs and spices like turmeric and ginger and chili. Powder. Add some extra tamarind paste to your curry because you want to adjust your seasonings and your flavors if necessary. We're embellishing this and garnishing our fish curry with some fresh cilantro or coriander leaves, which you find on most Indian cuisines. 